Any of you seen these? Sold on Timo, Amazon. Apparently small rods that you can use to weld any type of metal only using a lighter. And no need for a tech welder or any type of welding machine. Well, to tell you the truth, I never believed it, but it's always worth to try. So here it is, we're about to give it a try and see if we can solder a section of this area or may maybe aluminum. So we'll try both, we'll try steel and aluminum and see what happens. Got a plumbing torch here, which should make things a lot easier. Okay, here we go. Oops. Gotta move that out of the way. So it only melts, but it's not actually doing anything. It doesn't stick to anything. Yeah, so I I tried a metal. Now let let me try aluminum. See what happens. No, it doesn't stick at all. It just melts, but yeah. yeah. You know what? I'm kind of curious. Let me try some. Okay, I'm a little curious, and I hope I'm wrong about this. But I think they're selling us these little bars and they're actually solder for copper plumber solder that you can buy in rolls so if you want them in little strips all you have to just pull them out of the roll set them up straight cut them in pieces and that's about it but if that's the case oh well that's a very tricky dirty scam right there so we're about to find out Okay, so it doesn't stick to aluminum, it doesn't stick to steel, and it doesn't stick to copper. Okay, plumber's solder this time. Okay, now plumber's solder works nice in copper. Now... Let's see if it works on aluminum. It's not meant for that, but since that other did not work, maybe we can find out what does. Mm -hmm. Right. Okay.
Interesting. Well, it doesn't stick to the aluminum. It only sticks to copper. Now, let's try the steel. Uh, no, but I didn't put flux though. So let's try putting flux, see what that does. Whoa, looks like I'm cooking something. It's like I burned your carpet. That's okay. <laughs> well, this one did bond to the steel. Look at that. It, it I put plenty of flux. Yeah. And it bond yeah. to the steel. Look at that. Oh, really? Yeah. It'll work pretty good. Mm -hmm. See that? Yeah. Uh, it's going to be hot. Yeah. Oh. See? Oh, yeah. So we can use actually in that uh, plumbers okay. solder for steel for welding steel, and it's so damn strong. See that? Yeah. Oh yeah. You said you using the solder or just this? No, no, no. These yes. things didn't work. These are from uh, yeah. Amazon, and these are the kind you get on Timu uh -huh. that promise you that you can weld anything, and it's not true. Doesn't work no, on anything. Not. <laughs> It didn't work on steel, but, uh, it didn't work on um, the aluminum, and it didn't work on copper. Now we know that plumbers uh, solder works on copper, but yeah. what I didn't know is that it worked on steel though, and it does. You just put plenty of flux and uh -huh. it welds it nicely. Hmm. And on, on here, on the aluminum it doesn't, it just kind of like rolls over, like this big old chunk. All right. Yeah. So this is what happens when it's on aluminum. On steel, it's really on there. Hmm. So you're using the you're using the solder. Yeah. Well, now I know what else to use solder on. And this is uh. Read what it is. Okay. Now you all saw it. So if you were thinking of buying any of these, an entire package and probably stock on 20, 40 of these because you thought you could do miracles with it. Trust me, it's not. You're not going to have any miracles. The only miracle you'll probably have is uh, disappear all the money from your wallet.